Welcome to our training on the Brand Analytics Market Basket Analysis Report. Brands enrolled in the Amazon Brand Registry enjoy access to a suite of additional selling benefits, including the Brand Analytics tool in Seller Central. In this video, we'll review the features and functionality of one of the reports you'll find in Brand Analytics, Market Basket Analysis. This report displays products that customers have purchased in combination with a brand's products, or they can use it to assess cross-marketing opportunities. You can access the Market Basket Analysis Report and others in the Brand Analytics tool if you're a seller internal to a brand enrolled in Brand Registry. Simply select Brands in the main menu in Seller Central, then click Brand Analytics, or click All Brand Benefits, then locate the Brand Analytics card. For more information about access to Brand Analytics and other Brand Registry tools, see our modules in Seller University about requesting or managing access to Brand Selling Benefits. After accessing the Brand Analytics tool, you can select Market Basket Analysis from the list of reports at the top of the screen. The report lists your brand's products according to the number of orders received across all sellers. That means it captures your orders as well as any orders received by other sellers who list your products. In the row for each product, you'll see its ASIN and the number of orders received. You'll also see the three products that are most frequently purchased at the same time. Those three products will be listed by title and ASIN. They can belong to your brand or to a competitor. Next to all three products, you'll see a combination percent. That's the number of times the product was purchased with your product, divided by the number of times any product was purchased with your product. For example, a flower pot that's part of your brand was purchased 10 times with one other product. It was purchased four times with the first product shown in the Market Basket Analysis Report, which is another flower pot that's part of your brand. It was purchased three times with the second product in the report, which is a pack of seeds that's also part of your brand. It was purchased two times with the third product in the report, which is a watering can that isn't part of your brand. And it was purchased one time with a garden hose not shown in the report. In this scenario, the combination percent for the top three products shown in the report would be 40%, 30% and 20%. When you first access the Market Basket Analysis Report, it'll be defaulted to show your products across all categories and brands for the previous week. You can use the drop-down menus at the top to view a specific time period. When doing so, keep in mind that data is generally available in Brand Analytics within 72 hours. After selecting a time period, click the Apply button to refresh the report. You can also use filters to narrow the report so that the three products shown only belong to your brand or so that they only belong to competitors. Click Show Filters, then use the first drop-down menu to select either Same Brand Combination Only or Same Brand Combination Excluded. You can use the other drop-down menu to narrow the report to a specific brand. Or, to narrow the report to a specific set of products, you can enter up to 100 ASINs in the search bar, separated by either a space or comma. After setting filters, click the Refine Results button to refresh the report. If you'd like to add or remove columns on the Market Basket Analysis Report, click Customize Columns on the right-hand side. Then check or uncheck boxes in the pop-up. Click the Save button to return to the updated report. To download a copy of the report, click the Generate Download button. Then, in the pop-up, select either Simple View to download the report you see on screen or select Comprehensive View to download the report with all relevant columns. Click the Generate Download button to start your download, which you can monitor by accessing the Download Manager. Finally, if you want more information about how a specific metric is calculated, click Metrics Glossary to see a set of comprehensive definitions. On the Metrics Glossary page, you can expand each section to see additional details. 
we encourage brands to use all the features and functionality of the Market Basket Analysis Report to gain insights into their performance in the Amazon Store. Use it to understand how you might encourage sales of multiple products within your brand, or use competitor products to identify opportunities to expand your catalog. This concludes our overview of the Market Basket Analysis Report. If you'd like step-by-step -step instructions for other brand analytics reports, see our series of modules in Seller University. Thank you and happy selling in the Amazon Store.